Well, Ramar, how does it feel to score your first professional goal today? Um, can't lie, I'm over the moon to score my first professional goal. Um, it was a long time coming. Um, just happy we get the three points today. And yeah, just go again next week. Did you think that goal would come so early in the season for you? Yeah, yeah. I wanted to start off the season scoring. Hopefully I can do it again next week. Maybe if I get more time, I'll probably get two or three. What was it like watching the, the game in the early stages? What did you think? Um, I thought that the other team was a bit shaky and there was a lot of gaps where we could exploit. So that's that's why when I scored my goal now, pulled off, go through the little gaps. You know. First half, you know, Edinburgh were perhaps feeling slightly aggrieved to be behind, but I thought we were deserving of the lead. Would you agree or not? Yeah, I thought we deserved the lead. I thought we were the better team in the first half. I thought we dominated and was more in their half all the time, putting pressure onto them. They got a few couple chances, but we was more on top, I thought. Slightly perhaps fortunate with the deflection on the, the first goal, but ultimately we deserved to be ahead at that point then. Yeah, I thought that we deserved to be ahead, definitely. How crucial was the second goal? Because Edinburgh City, to sorry, FC Edinburgh, apologies, um, t to their credit, they were asking a few questions of our defence at that point. Yeah, I thought it was vital that we got the second goal because, you know, when it's 1-0, anything can happen. And if they nick a goal, it's a different game after that. So when we scored that second goal, it kind of just settles the game down and we can just calm down. And from a player perspective, does that just settle the nerves a little bit as well? Yeah, coming on, it was, it's easier when, you know, 2-0 up, just coming on, you kind of just either seeing out the game or trying to get another goal. We saw yourself and Ola getting a few instructions. What was what was said? Oh, it was just getting behind, chase the defender, chase the defenders. Because obviously, coming on that late in the game, two centre backs will be tired. So keep making the runs and keep putting them under pressure. Talk us through the goal. Oh, okay, so um, young Pierce, great player, um, just peeled off to the side. Seeing that obviously the defender wasn't going to come with me, Pierce over the top. Obviously, I used my pace down the line, come inside just put into the corner, easy. Robbie, to his credit, he had a few big saves today. Was there uh, any nervousness when he came rushing out at the end? Nah, no nervousness at all. Just calm, composed, put it in the corner. Bit of a cool customer, you, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. For the fans, obviously, this was the first time that many of them may have had the chance to have a look at you. What can they expect from you this season in terms of style of play? A lot of in behind. I'm more one, more, you know, hold up, me, I'm more in behind. Balls over the top, balls through, I'm all pace, <laughs> all pace. And with that in mind, I guess on a personal level, is the, the immediate aim just to try and force your way into the first team and, and get games? Yeah, my aim now is to you know get into the starting lineup, score more goals, you know keep getting the wins because ultimately at the end of the season we're going for promotion, on promotion. And just finally, it's Queen of the South back at the Falkirk Stadium next weekend. On a, a personal level, just hopeful that the manager might uh, might give you the nod. Yeah, hopefully because. Uh, Last year against Queen of the South, I did get a nice assist. A nice assist to get a nice draw there. So. Well, here's hoping. Congratulations on the, the first professional goal today and uh, thanks for your time. Thank you.